Hi Gems, hi Geminis, you are welcome to my channel uh, Answers by Divine and this shall be for your June 2017 uh, we have got the general reading and the love reading so let's begin with your general reading for June 2017 uh, I will just continue to shuffle while I speak on uh, the intuitive insights that I have gathered for you Gems um, let's first begin with uh the first point that i have noted that you could i feel i feel that some of you gems you could be um you could be i, I feel that you're feeling happy right now uh there's a sense of uh happiness blissfulness sweet uh sweet blissful uh, uh that's happening to you you're thinking about you know all the good things that have ha that have actually happened to you so um you feel relaxed you you're feeling happy uh, you're feeling contented uh, and in fact with that energy you are actually planning to move forward you are actually planning some uh, future plans ahead uh, and some of you but some of you however could be could have some minor minor heartache uh, why is that so I, I feel like you have your minor heartache because some of the regrets um, whatever that had happened to you right now all the good things that had happened to you right now you actually made you regret uh, you know some of the actions from the past uh, you you know you just feel like if you could you would just you like to undo uh, undo certain things that or certain decisions that you had made uh, for yourself previously okay and um, in terms of your domestic matters, it, it feels like all is peaceful, all is good. There's, there's really nothing major happening uh, that or that's occupying you at the moment. You're thinking about your work, your job. Uh, you're trying to make new arrangement, uh, new schedule, um, new arrangements uh, to your job. I'm not too sure whether if you are wanting to change a job or but I don't feel I don't feel that uh, as strong as to just in the current environment you will be staying but however you just uh, you are actually wanting some changes or making some uh, uh, arrangement a different arrangement okay and uh, you are actually okay the arrangement is actually going to accommodate your life your current life situation you probably have got uh, you know your love life or your family domestic dynamics uh, which actually requires you to make some arrangements, some new changes. So that is actually for accommodating of your other aspects of life. So some of you uh, have got tasks on hand uh, waiting for completion. Uh, this is as of 30th of May. I'm doing this on the 30th of May, Europe time, uh, uh, Northern Europe. I'm actually right now in Finland. So... Um, yeah, I, I feel that some of you is actually, um, uh, uh, you know, awaiting, awaiting for a completion of a task or some task on, uh, on your plate right now. And I feel, and I feel that, uh, some of you gems, you, you're, you're having, you having a good relationship with your friends, with your flat, with your, with your close family, uh, your friends, your, um, your love your love if you have got any love loved ones uh love partners uh your husband your wife your boyfriend your girlfriend your new date i feel like everything is good um uh among among these dynamics with uh with you and of course you are um i i i see that you are on the road on the road much uh you know more often than you from than than usual um and while you are on the road, when while you are actually on the road, driving, traveling, sitting in a in a in a bus or in a train, or uh, while you are traveling or even in a in a plane, I feel that uh, whatever that's going through on your mind is um the plans and the future ahead. You're looking at what's ahead, uh, what could be ahead of you, okay? And uh, we will do start on with your general reading with a nine card spread, uh, three cards each time. So the bottom of the deck, we have got eight of ones in reverse. So generally, um, the general energy for you, it looks like, you know, um, your life is coming, 
a part of your life is coming to um is coming to slow down i don't feel really strongly like like um total stop or total halt on in your life but i feel more like it's slowing down it's gradually slowing down because i always explain this card is like going fast progressive uh shooting in but in this reverse position especially for you gems i feel like uh it's sliding it's slowly sliding back um coming to stagnation over here i don't feel it's anything bad like you know it's um it's things are, are becoming from good to bad or bad to worse i don't feel that it's just um probably i okay the word over here is sta stable okay it's stabilizing right now uh, your general energy is that things are getting more stable for you so this is the eight of wands as your general energy so over here um of the three cards we have got the first card over here which is the empress um <coughs> The Empress, I would actually, um, I read this Empress card as in, you know, this is a lady, a woman, a mother of the family, the, the woman who's holding, who's holding the family very closely, uh, you know, holding it up uh, together, holding everyone together, um, making it looking more like a family. So, you, in, you know, in order to maintain, usually if you were to maintain a family, um, the, the female, the female or the mother, of the 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 woman of the house okay the woman of the house is the one that's keeping everyone uh together so we have got empress does it mean that you have got uh are you the one gems if you are a female female uh uh what uh, uh uh watcher could you be the one could you be the one are you could you be the one that's actually, you know, doing, uh, keeping it all together, holding the family together, uh, probably like arranging activities to, to get everyone to come back, uh, to be participating in a family affair? Or if you are a male, could you be behaving like a female, uh, uh, um, the head of the house, uh, like a, like a mother, like a, fem a, a feminine figure over here? Or could you be meeting someone? Could you be meeting someone who is, who is actually you know offering you this uh 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 fe feminine figure uh you know to keep to keep your household together to keep your family dynamics together um i always like to talk about family when i see the empress um it is a very feminine energy so either you if you are a male watching this video it could be you are you are playing the role of this or if not then uh, you could have someone of this uh, feed, uh, of this energy among uh, among or surrounding you or you could have met someone okay so that's the Empress we have got the Knight of Wands okay and the Knight of Wands in this position it means that you know this uh, this Knight over here uh, he is going to pursue his his um, his ambitions uh, his hopes, his uh, needs and his wants, his wishes. He he has identified what was that, and then he's going towards uh going towards to achieve to achieve whatever he has uh he has all along in his mind. However, this is in reverse. I don't feel like it's anything negative about this card. It feels like you know uh, I mean okay this this sentence this phrase just comes to my mind. It feels like nothing matters anymore to you. It's like nothing really matters anymore to you did you what was the, what was it that made you felt that way gems what was it that made you felt that way why is it that all the things that you actually wanted that you hoped for no longer matters to you anymore now because we have the knight of wands in reverse let's see what are the next few cards that's coming up we have got the page of pentacles okay page of pentacles young enthusiastic energy going uh uh interested in finances working for money uh but however it is in reverse are you stopping are you stopping your career your work your finances uh progression uh, it feels like you are stopping uh you are stopping it or it is coming to a stop um i'm not sure because why you are not going forward to chase after your dreams anymore something something made you stop and this page of pentacles it is also stopping it is also coming to a stop 
does it not matter to you anymore um, in terms of financial gems? Let's see what other cards are coming out. It looks like to me that you have got this perfection, this perfection around you, among you, and then nothing else matters anymore. Just nothing else matters anymore. Okay. We have got five of wands, okay? Five of wands. Why is there a fight? Why is there a fight? It looks, everything looks good because five of wands. I'm stuck, I'm stumbled for a while. Does this mean, um, you know, you're working on the arrangement that you had that I just mentioned that you are working on arrangement? You are you going to fight for the best arrangement for yourself? Because I don't feel like there's any negative energy in this five of wands, even though it looks like, you know, there's a fight, uh, you know, among, among a few of you going on. I don't feel very strongly in as in how the picture is, um, is reflecting the meaning of it. But I feel like probably... You are fighting for what you want. You are fighting for your stand. Your stand, your needs, your wants. And this is a wants card. Five of wands. I feel that you're going to achieve. You're going to achieve. You're going to fight for what you wanted for uh, in this in this in this spread over here you are going to fight for you know fight for new arrangement the best arrangement to accommodate life you believe and you have your ground to stand you are standing really firmly on it and here you are fighting i don't i don't i really do not sense that it's anything like a, a negative vibe or energy over here we have got the six of swords six of swords in reverse all right in this in this position it means i i feel like in this position it means really long far away traveling like let's talk about 10,000 10,000 miles 10,000 kilometers away uh, but however it is in reverse i still feel that it is a traveling card it is a traveling but however it should be a pretty short distance pretty short distance um why are you traveling why are you traveling? Let's see what other cards are playing out because I feel like uh, if we base on the current spread over here, nothing else matters to you anymore, not even pentacles. You are fighting for the best arrangement and you are traveling. Could it be because of traveling? Uh, traveling issues uh, that either you have to travel or someone else has got to travel for you uh, this traveling is very much relevant to uh, relevant to you so you probably you just um, are you accommodating are you accommodating we just mentioned about accommodating life you want the best arrangement to accommodate life however uh, at the moment you are still need needed to travel uh, uh, quite a fair bit quite a fair bit not the furthest but quite a fair bit right now in this month of june so could you be could you be thinking about new arrangement or the best arrangement to accommodate to life all right so this is the short traveling card we have got the justice the justice in upright uh i i sense i sense quickly and immediately that you are in a very clear um clear uh uh you are having a very clear uh, perspective of how what what things are right now how things are right now um the situation you are being very logical it's not like you are being biased or uh, non-neutral you are very neutral here uh and it feels more like being very logical you are very logical in this in this spread over here okay Let's see what other cards are playing out because if I see you, nothing else matters to you anymore. It's like the ones doesn't matter to you anymore. The page of pentacles doesn't matter to you anymore. Yet you are still being logical. How is that be? Because if you are being logical, you will still pursue whatever that you want. You want to be pursuing, but however, uh, it's saying something different. So let's see what are the three other cards coming up for you. So the next card we have is the Hermit in reverse. Uh, I feel like you are not alone. 
um, you are not alone. You have, uh, it's, it seems like, you know, you have found yourself a partner, a uh, partner in crime, companionship, uh, a new partnership. If you are single, you probably have a very close friend or very close um, uh, contact whom you are uh, getting close with uh, I just feel like close there's a there's a sense of closeness over here someone someone who is close to you is actually standing by your side is actually standing very close to you uh, being supportive because in this position this is this hermit is alone shining his own lights uh, finding his own pathways but right now it is actually in reverse I, I I feel that it just means the total opposite to this card you have have you gotten yourself a, a partner in crime someone else to be walking this um, you know the, the the next phase or the next stage of life or the current the current um, you know the current uh, walking with you with the current right now current as in the current experience the current events that you are um uh, uh that you are dealing with right now are you having someone accompanying you through this journey it feels like it is you have someone over here and here is the sun okay this sun is in an upright position which is fantastic which is super damn good um uh, let's see how the sun is shining on which card it feels very strongly that the sun is shining on this short distance travel whatever that is making you traveling a short distance is you have got the sun supporting you it's like this this is necessary whatever this traveling is about it it is necessary uh, it is necessary to happen and with that traveling it actually brings you a good outcome I feel very strongly on this because it's not about the night of wands it's not about the Knight of Wands. I mean, what, why would the sun be, 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 be with this card? It's not about the Page of Pentacles. I mean, if you do not care about finances anymore, how, how good would that be? Or if you are fighting for, you know, for whatever uh, arrangement that you have, you are actually wanting, probably because, again, earlier on, we talked about this Five of Wands, trying to make, uh, find the best arrangement for, to accommodate your life. Uh, with this because that's short traveling so the Sun could be coupling up with these three cards do you see that okay and here we have the page of swords all right the page of swords is a young energy again uh, enthusiastic interested uh, uh, is a sword are you ready to start a new phase it feels like to me there is a new new phase new start to your life uh, there's a new beginning, new chapter that's uh, that's actually um, um, uh, playing out for you, and you are ready to take it all on. You are ready to to conquer to conquer the world. This is this is like it's like you you are feeling young again. There's this so much energy in you. You're feeling so young again. Someone over here could it be this empress that's you know holding everything together for you, or because you have got your life arranged, your life arrangement. Is all intact uh, everything is good you feel good again and hence you are ready to conquer to take on the world again okay so this is the page of Pentacles so overall let's see uh, with these nine cards over here how does it resonate with the earlier intuition uh, and insights that I have gotten for you um, you're thinking about the good things that's happening to you uh, mainly because you have got this uh, you have the arrangement cards the five of wands fighting for the best arrangement uh, you feel relaxed happy relaxed and happy you have this everything is intact everything is being hold, held on together uh, there's togetherness over here with this Empress card uh, peaceful domestic again peaceful domestic we have the Empress who's uh, domestically uh, you know getting putting things uh, all together um, you know having having this the, the having everything together okay and um, you have some tasks on hand is it this you have some tasks on hand that's waiting to be completed you are going to conquer the world uh, it looks like you have an you have actually an agenda that you have identified what are you going to conquer uh, it's actually a task on your hand uh, and you are going to you are going to settle settle that settle whatever that's outstanding going to conquer that
Okay, so let's draw an advice card for you, James, uh, for June, for your general June 2017 reading. So let's see what advice do we have for James, June 2017 general reading. One last time. Okay, so let's see what are the cards that's going to flip out again. Okay, that, that is fast. Mm, you have your secrets. Your secrets are safe. Your secrets are safe. What is it that you are keeping a secret? What is it that you are keeping a secret, James? You know what? Earlier we have got this Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands. And we have got this Page of Pentacles. Which I can't actually tell what, what are these two cards supposed to mean. Because is that is that your secret? Is that your secret um the secret that you're holding that you're keeping to yourself? Your secrets are safe. I feel like I feel like you have got some. Mm, it feels like to me. Previously, previously, uh, it feels like long time back, long time, really long time back. Uh, you had your plans for whatever is happening today. You had your plans for whatever is, whatever is happening today. Long, long before you have already planned for this outcome, this situation, this scenario. Today, what you are going through today, in this month, is exactly what you had imagined. It is exactly what you had imagined, what you had hoped for what you had wanted. Could that be the reason why whatever dreams or achievement that you're wanting to achieve no longer no longer um, serves you anymore? Because it's like before now, before now, uh, you know, that's what, that, that is what that keeps you going. I feel like because of this, I feel like it's because of this Empress. I feel like it's because of this Empress. You don't need this anymore. But why do you not need this anymore? It's actually a secret. You probably have got, you know, enough enough savings. Uh enough savings, enough financial plans before you had your you had your financial planning be done before and today in this situation you no longer need this page of pentacles energy. You no longer need that because you had it all well planned, all saved up. You have got probably um savings enough, sufficient, sufficiency in you. And then we have got the Knight of Wands. Uh Knight of Wands as in you have actually achieved, you have gotten in this month, you probably would have gotten whatever you had actually hoped for in the life, in your life, this lifetime. You have, it's coming true to you. It's coming to you this month, James. It's coming to you. Whatever you are hoping for, whatever you are, you know, you, you have been searching for your whole life. You have actually start, start, started to see this coming to you and... You no longer need this, and that is why it is in reverse. You no longer need this. And this is your secrets. Your secrets are safe. Okay? I guess it's, it, it, it looks like a very good situation here uh, here for you in this month of June, Gems. Um, but if there should be any secrets, I feel like it's actually for a good cause. It's not like deception or lies or anything. Um, I feel very much like you know, you have got everything prepared, everything prepared for this, for, 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 even for this arrangement that you wanted, that you are going to work on. 
you know, you will have already planned and for, foresee that this, this will happen one day. You're going to make this arrangement and this short distance traveling. I feel like you already know, you already know that, you know, you know, you know, and you have already expected long and way before that such things is going to happen for you this month and it's coming true. But you're just not saying, I guess it's just in within you. You just know it. You probably are not confident about, you know, about telling, telling whatever you, you had predicted, you had forecast out for yourself, for your life. Now, today, whatever that's happening, all the good things that's happening, you probably had all this imagined for yourself before, but you haven't actually let this out, let the cat out of the basket. You, you did not. You probably were not confident about, you know, sharing what you, what you, what you actually think you actually deserve. And here you have... Your secrets are safe. All right, so that's pretty much the general energy for gems. Um, general reading for gems June twenty seventeen, and uh, let's move on to your love reading. Uh, for gems, love reading June twenty seventeen. Let's see what's going to play out for gems June twenty seventeen. Okay, I will just shuffle one more time. Oh, gems, I just read back on my notes again. I saw that I have written this. There was some heartache. There was some heartache that you had. Some minor regrets. Uh, some minor regrets that you had. It is a happy set. It's a bittersweet kind of uh, events that you, that, you, that you may have for yourself previously. Um, I just I just couldn't get over you know the advice card where your secrets are safe. Could it mean you know your past your past were a secret before? Did you had a really adventurous past that you are not willing to share it out uh, today in this in this needful time of your life? The secrets you are con you are going to continue to keep on to lock the secrets down within you. I feel that I feel that I feel that. Okay, so for gems, um, love spread for June twenty seventeen. Let's begin again with three cards for a total of nine card spread. All right, so let's see which other cards that got, that's gonna jump out again. Um, first three cards please, three cards for gems, love reading June 2017. Can I have three cards please for gems, love reading June 2017. Three cards for gems, love reading June 2017. Can I have three cards, please? Okay. Ace of Cups. I just I just have a sense, I just have a feel like feel, you know, like just now when the when the card says your secrets are safe, I get a sense of relief. After I put the card back to the deck and just ended the reading for general reading, I just have a sense of relief. Gems, are you having a really um, dark secret for yourself from the past that is not supposed to be shared, that you can't actually share or let it out of the bag? It feels like you want to continue, you want it to continue to keep, to keep that secret. You know that, could it be that you know that it would be a disaster if you let that out, if you talk about it? Okay. We just need one more card for gems. 
love reading for June 2017. I'm quite worried for you, James, because I see the card that that's supposedly not the best card, not a good sign. But let's see what other cards is coming out uh, shortly. I just need one more card uh, to begin with, and hopefully it ends with a happy note. Just one more card, please, for James Love Life. For June 2017. Can I have one more card? For Gems. Love Life. Love Reading for June 2017. One more card please. It's not coming out Gems. Yours is the... Earlier on I had this one other um, video which actually take quite some time to get the cards jumping out. You are the next, you are the second. Okay, here we have, I've got. Okay, so for the bottom of the deck, we have got the Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles over here in reverse. Okay, um, if it's actually in an upright position, your general energy for the deck, if it's in an upright position, it means that, you know, uh, there are some convincing that needs to be done in terms of financial stability. You are trying to sell to, to, to cross-sell, to upsell yourself over here uh, to the two couples here on, on, on this side, okay? So, but it is actually in reverse. I guess in terms of financial stability, it feels very, very much like nothing needs to be said. You know, all, all that is said has been said before, um, you know, or, or rather it could be obvious enough. It's like uh, what your... You, your energy right now is is obvious you are already showing and portraying how uh what you have right now in terms of the pentacles and there's no there's no need for further elaboration that is your general energy in terms of your love life i feel like you feel competent in your financial stability financial status right now so this being your general energy okay and uh, let's begin with the cards the first card we have got the ace of cups Ace of Cups. Um, it looks like you are offering offering your uh, love, offering love emotions. Uh, or could it be you are being offered? But it looks like you know the hands are are giving it back. It looks like it's giving it back. Uh, it feels very much like it's coming from you, James. It's coming from you. You are offering your love, your love, your heart. You have got a lot to offer over here in terms of relationship and the heart matters, okay? Um, this is the card that I, I'm quite uh, bothered with because we have got the sun in reverse. The sun in reverse, it may, it may just mean that, you know, if it's a sun in upright position, it's the best, uh, it's the most ideal situation. But however, I feel that when it's actually in reverse, honestly speaking, I've got quite a negative vibe coming from this uh, for the sun in reverse uh, it feel like it is all not yet perfection in this relationship yet could there still be more uh, to be looking forward to that is not whatever you are seeing whatever you are seeing right now is not quite yet uh, the full picture that you are seeing right now uh, in this love relationship so uh, I guess it means that you have to be more observant in your love life, in your love relationship. It is not, whatever you see is not actually what it is all about. There could be more underneath. And here we have the sun in reverse. And here, the next card, we have got the seven of swords. Seven of swords in reverse, okay? Um, in an upright position, it feels like you're about it. Your, hand, your hands are tied down. However, it is in reverse. It's still very much mean to me. Like uh, you are still um, being bounded, being bounded by, you know, by the, the defenses, the gates over here. Uh, just that probably your hands could be released. Um, but still, I think you, it is, you are still in an in a enclosed environment where... Um, Probably it sends to me like uncertainty, uncertainty 
that um, in, in the current situation right now, there are still uncertainty. You're not sure whether, uh, you know, if you should be moving or but you're not sure whether whatever you are seeing right now is as it is, is as is at, as it is right now. Okay, let's see what the other cards are playing out for you. The next card we have got the five of cups in reverse. So in an upright position, you are uh one thing to be alone. You are actually left alone, left alone. However, it is actually in reverse. I guess uh for those of you who are single, you could you most likely you had you had uh you had met somebody new. You are talking. You are very close with someone that you are seeing, uh very often, very closely. Or if you are in a partnership, or uh, uh, it should be a very blissful partnership right now for you because you are no longer alone. You have got someone else together with you, standing together with you, dealing with the cups. Okay, why did I say dealing with the cups? Do I want to say something like, uh, there may be there may be some obstacles. It feels like there may be some obstacles that uh in in this partnership that uh both of you could be could be could be facing um it feels like you know both of you are, are are standing together as one uh managing the situation together so you are not alone but there's definitely situation that both of you have to work on together to overcome the obstacles over here okay and here we have got the knight of cups okay the knight of cups so in a in an upright position it means that you know uh you, you are going ahead to offer you are going to fight for your love you are because a knight is a warrior a knight is a warrior you are uh you know you are holding the emotions the emotions the love the offerings in your hand you are going to offer going to fight for more for more of going to fight um for your love to give to offer what you have on your hands so however it is in a reverse position it feels like the word contemplating is coming to me uh it feels it feels like you know there's some contemplation over here uh you're you're not too sure there's some there's actually some uncertainty or uh, there's some doubts in this situation in this love reading love uh love life uh partnership for you uh, are there any certain uncertainty or doubts that you are dealing with, you are facing or experiencing right now, gems? Okay, let's see what the other cards are um, coming out for you. And uh, pro probably if we could, we'll come back to this card. And here we have the lovers. I feel that the, the, the someone who, who you are dealing with right now um, may look to you like, you know, the, the love of your life is somebody whom you have been searching for your whole life is this is the lover's card is 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 being blessed is being blessed by the angel the angel over here in this card uh and it's actually especially good in upright position uh it's it's like predestined it's a predestined uh um it's a faithful faithful um uh uh partner that you are uh that you have found for yourself right now so that's the lover's card. Let's see the next three cards. What do we have? Remembering we have the Knight of Cups in reverse. Why are you holding it back? Are there any doubts that you're having? Even though it is meant to be a predestined love, it's the love of your life. But why are you holding it back? Let's see. Okay. So the next card we have got five of pentacles in reverse so um five of pentacles um it feels like to me you know out in the cold chasing for finances working on finances however it is in reverse when this five of pentacles in reverse uh appears in your spread it feels like to me you are ignoring the current financial uh, situation that you are um uh or having it right now um it's like there could be some finances uh, work that you have to work on. However, it is in reverse. You may be overlooking or trying to look past this situation right now. You're trying to look past the situation and um, it looks like you are moving forward. You are moving forward or... No, it just looks like you are moving forward. You are trying to look past this financial situation that you have 
for yourself at the moment okay and here we have got the nine of pentacles in reverse i like to read nine in reverse uh something lesser than nine would be an eight eight of pentacles eight of pentacles it means that uh you'll be working on your finances you'll be working on your finances so uh did it contradict did it contradict this five of pentacles in reverse because when i say you are trying to look past the financial uh the finances uh or the financial situation right now because it's five is in a cold you are supposed to be working to be chasing after your finances however you choose to over uh oversee that over look past look past this situation and here you have got the eight uh nine of pentacles in reverse okay nine of pentacles in reverse is less than fulfillment uh, you're still working on it. So I guess when these two cards come out appear together um, It's something that you just have to you just have to deal with it. You have to face this you have to face this issue financial financially Within your love relationship. It, it, it is definitely a big topic in your love relationship in your love life